Thank goodness it's Friday. I'm Nicola Thorne. Over one million seabirds have died from starvation. And I'm Caitlin Workman. Elon Musk is planning on sending a million people to Mars. We've got the details. The news is next. Remember, today is Jersey Day for our boys basketball home against Middleton tonight at 7.30 p.m. Please wear your favorite jersey of any sport and we'll see you at the game tonight as we cheer our Bulldogs on to victory. Anyone interested in cosmetology school? Aveda Institute will be here today for a presentation. Please visit the College and Career Center for more info and to sign up. BPA will have a district meeting this coming Tuesday, January 21st after school here at NHS in room 269. They will also have a BPA lunch meeting on Tuesday, January 28th during lunch in room 269. The lost and found car has been moved from the office to the cafeteria. If you have lost anything this semester, please make sure you check it out and see if it is there. Please leave the hangers. Small items such as jewelry, keys, etc. should be asked for at the front desk. You're in it. Do you have it? Yep, you're going to want to remember how cool you were in high school and your kids can't laugh at your haircut if they can't see it. Buy your yearbook today for $70. See Mrs. Curry in the bookkeeper's office. Remember, there's no school this Monday, January 20th, due to Martin Luther King Human Rights Day. Enjoy your three-day weekend. Today's activities, Cheer Up Valley Classic Cheer Competition at Madison High School, JV Wrestling at Padilla International, Boys Basketball versus Middleton High School here. ...is hosting their annual winter fundraiser on Monday, January 20th. We will be showing the movie Abominable in the cafeteria at 1 p.m. on the 20th, with doors opening at 12.30. There will be concessions available, like pizza, popcorn, and baked goods. Tickets are $3 for people aged 13 and up, $2 for kids aged 4 to 12, and all children, 3 and under, are free. But young children must have an adult present. We are not babysitters. Today's weather is brought to you by Dr. Kim Keller. Your smile is your first impression. Make it a great one and see Dr. Keller today. Today we can expect a high of 39 and a low of 28, and tomorrow a high of 39 and a low of 26. Back to you. A million seabirds died in less than a year as a result of what scientists called a giant blob of hot ocean, according to a new research. A study released by the University of Washington found the birds, ca found the birds called common murders probably died of starvation between the summer of 2015 and the spring of 2016. Most dead seabirds never washed ashore. So while 62,000 dead or dying murs were found along the coasts of Alaska, Washington, Oregon, and California, researchers estimate the total number is closer to 1 million. Alaska saw the most birds washed up in Prince William Sound in southern Alaska. More than 4,500 bird carcasses were found at every kilometer. The first SpaceX Starship orbital prototypes aren't even built yet, but Elon Musk already has big plans for his company's spacecraft, which includes turning humans into an interplanetary species with the presence on Mars. He crunched some of the numbers he has in mind on Twitter on Thursday. Musk doesn't want to just launch a few intrepid souls to Mars. He wants to send a whole new nation. Recently, he tossed out a goal of building 100 starships per year to send about 100,000 people from Earth to Mars every time the planet's orbits line up right. How often do the Earth and Mars line up right? Roughly every 26 months. Musk's vision involves loading 1,000 starships into orbit and then sending them off over the course of a month. The SAT word of the day is ethereal which means very light, air, heavenly. You could use it like this. When you're talking desserts, a good moose should be ethereal. That's the news. Thanks for watching and remember, live, live the, the Bulldog, Bulldog way. way.